we are talking about colorectal cancer and um, what are the what are the recommendation by the CDC uh, to test colorectal cancer because most of you uh, this is year 2020 most of you understand that um, we lost a very young person uh, Chadwick Boseman I liked his I liked Chadwick Boseman because of his movies and um, because um, you know he's, he was a good human being and I thought about talking about colorectal cancer especially to our black to everybody but also to our black community um because uh, of disparities in healthcare most of the black people or black community we do not have access to healthcare that we can actually be tested for colorectal cancer so this that is what we're going to discuss about today uh, colorectal cancer is one of the cancers that is very progressive and uh, uh, also if it is detected early it can save lives and um, the three methods that are recommended by the cdc is uh, the high sensitivity fecal occult fecal occult blood test that is where they test the fecal blood meaning the blood in the your stool they test it three times. If you have blood in your stool, that is not normal. You need to be tested right away. Any blood in your stool is not normal. So you need to be tested right away. So the other one, the other test that we test people with the um, colon, colon cancer or colon uh, testing for colon cancer is also the second one is called flexible sigmendoscopy um they test it they go to your colon they test it if it is okay you have another five years to test the other one which is the gold standard is colonoscopy where they go you take they prep you you take stool softeners and laxatives you, it clears your system. You poop a lot, clears your system. They prep for you like a 24 hours. You poop, poop, poop. When the poop is all gone, then the, you go in. They can do it the, under general or under sedative so that you are not uncomfortable. Uh, they go in with a, a, a camera and they check. If they find any pull-ups, there anything that they feel that it's not supposed to be there they take a sample they send it to the lab if it is uh, if it is it is benign meaning it is not cancerous then you have another 10 years to be tested but if they find something that they don't like there that or the or this the the test of the pull-ups find that it is a uh, cancerous then you have to go after one year after six months how your doctor your gastrointestinal doctor is going to tell you um what to follow you have to follow it um so the gold standard is colonoscopy nowadays they came up with something they call color guard the color guard we use it so much in the office color guard it is another system they send you a cup at, at your home you poop at your home put it in the cup send it to the labs they send it, you can post it send it to the labs they go check it if they feel that you need further testing then you will go for further testing but the cdc recommends that anybody over age 50 i would rather you do a colonoscopy because that is a gold standard though anytime you're over 50 do a colonoscopy anytime you have a family member who has had any kind of cancer be it breast cancer be it uh, prostate cancer any immediate family member immediate family member meaning your mom your dad your aunties your sisters you need even if you are not 50 
you need to go for a colonoscopy. When you are 40, you need to go for a colonoscopy. You'll be tested. If it is okay, they can give you another three years, you'll be tested. You, you will save life if you go get tested for that. First degree relative, any history of cancer in the family. If you've been exposed to radiation, maybe you when you were young, you had a... Um, you had a uh, cancer and you are exposed to radiation, then you need to be tested. They also said, uh, recommend any person who has Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis diseases. This is the, the diseases where people have issues with pooping, pooping, pooping a lot. And, and so they recommend anybody who has had um, Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis to um, test go for tests for go for colonoscopy even if you are not 40 even if you are not 50 but if you have these issues i have a few patients who are who have ulcerative colitis and as providers we also need to remind our patients especially they have uh, they have uh crohn's disease we need to remind them that they need to go for a colonoscopy. We can give them a script so that they can go for a colonoscopy. So also, as the patients are trying to figure out this, we also, as providers, have to, it's our responsibility to remind patients that if you have history of cancer in the family, you need to be tested. If you have uh, been having Crohn's disease, ulcerative, uh, ulcerative colitis disease, you need to be tested. The good thing is with colonoscopy, if you're clear, clean, you have another 10 years. So 50, 60, 70, 10, it's a, a span of 10 years. So you are tested. So it is very important to follow the guidelines for co colorectal cancer or colon cancer so that you can avoid complication or death. Um, anybody who is over 76, the CDC recommends you don't have to be tested. Um, you can just test on individual. Maybe you have um, stomach pain, you feel uncomfortable, you have blood in the stool, or, or, or you just don't feel all right. Then you need to be tested. Anybody over 85, it is just, uh, you don't have to, it is, you know, on individual to individual basis i hope you will share this this can help somebody especially people who have family history you have had cancer before you have uh, uh, crohn's disease you need to be tested always ask your doctor this is just information i'm giving just information to help you know alert you put it in your calendar if you're over 50 to be tested for uh, colon, to go for colonoscopy, to be tested for colorectal cancer. Thank you. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Dr. Pam Obare Mogaka. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share among us our community. It might save life. And be blessed, Dr. Pam. Share, share on your on my YouTube channel. Share with your friends. Thank you. This is for all of us. Be blessed. Bye.